Hello, my name is Chloe Folan, and I just felt compelled to create another video this evening in response to questions that I've been receiving. I made a video a very short time ago as an introduction video to the Blessing Technique workshop that I have coming up in October. And there's been a fantastic response to that video with deeper queries. And around the same time, I've also been receiving deeper queries around the Earth star. So I've had people that are attending the workshop and also people that are very interested in the workshop ask me about the Earth star in relation to the blessing technique, but then also queries being emailed to me about the Earth star in general. So this video is for people who are in general interested about the Earth star and also the blessing technique. And at the moment, I only have one place remaining at the Blessing Technique Workshop in October, so please do contact me soon. Just a little bit about the Earth Star Chakra. So as most people are aware, the Earth Star Chakra is approximately six inches below the feet, and it has an extremely important function. In a very general sense, you can liken the Earth Star Chakra to the anchor of a ship. So as everyone knows, when a ship, when a boat wants to stop somewhere in the water, it puts an anchor down to keep it in place. And that is one of the functions of your Earth Star Chakra. When you are physically born and your chakra system starts to form, the Earth Star Chakra is the anchor that not only keeps you here in the physical, you know, grounded within your physical body, but it also helps keep your higher self anchored to you as well. So, a beautiful way of describing it is when you are out of form. Uh, your higher self is in the heavens, just being in the heavens. Then when you are physically born, and there is that union between you and your higher self, which I call the solar angel, your earth star helps keep you and your higher self anchored in form. And it would be one of the connection points between your form bodies of earth, air, fire, and water, meaning physical, emotional, and mental. So your earth star holds you as a personality in form while you're alive, as well as also helping your higher self to anchor to you while you are physically alive. Talking about the Earth Star in a more general sense, the Earth Star Chakra and the condition of the Earth Star also reflects how well you are able to make choices, make decisions, stick to those choices, and continue with healthy choices. So I'll gently go through that again. One of the other functions of the Earth Star and the condition of the Earth Star does dictate how well you're able to, number one, just even make healthy choices and decisions in the first place. How well you're then able to stick to those choices and then how well, you can hold on to those choices long enough to allow those choices and results of those choices to manifest in your life. It is a grounding chakra. It's one of the very important chakras in what has been commonly now called manifestation. So it's a very important chakra on many different levels, but this is only a short video. I would love to go into a lot more detail, but I do like to keep my videos as short as possible. 
So in terms of then working with the Earth Star Chakra and blessing and connecting with the Earth Star Chakra, I just want to bring up, and this is now in relation to my blessing technique workshop, Two moments, please, while I get up my screen share appropriately. So, with the blessing technique that I teach for working with the chakra system, the color orange with yellow, but orange in particular, orange is a color that has a lot of warmth and vitality to it. And that's what we want to do. We want to have a lot of warmth and vitality for our connection point here in form. The other piece of information I'd like to share about the Earth Star Chakra is it also helps keep you grounded within the reality around you. So being able to perceive reality around you, one of your filters for it. So when working with the earth star, we want that chakra to be warm with clarity. So orange is the color worked with. The symbol that I give for working with the earth star chakra is a spiral in a circle. And one particular earth angel, although a lot of people will know Gaia as a deity. But even deities can be likened to angelic in their life and approach to life. So Gaia would be the deity or very large, all encompassing earth angel who's worked with, went working with the earth star. And the prayer for working with the Earth Star is may Gaia heal my connection to Earth and all Earth's creatures. And give me two moments now while I bring up that prayer. Two moments, please. Perfect. So the symbol is a spiral, meaning the spiral of life, encompassed in a circle for unity. So if you would now like to experience a visualization for healing, blessing, and sealing the Earth Star Chakra, Please, first of all, make sure you are seated comfortably and that you're nice and relaxed. Gently bring your awareness down to your Earth Star Chakra, approximately six inches below your own feet. Become aware of a very warm, nurturing orange and yellow light starting to fill your earth star chakra. And gently now think of a decision you're making or an idea that you are trying to ground. Feel beautiful lines of orange light coming out of your earth star and connecting with decision you're trying to make, connecting with an idea you're trying to ground. And please now say a prayer. Please repeat after me. May Gaia heal my connection to Earth and all Earth's creatures.
feel that beautiful orange light between your earth star and your decisions, your earth star and ideas you're trying to ground, that orange light purifying the connection, healing any discord, clearing any blockages between making your decisions and ideas you're trying to ground. to seal and bless the process. Please now bring to mind the symbol here on the screen with your creative imagination, the circle with a spiral in it. Feel this symbol going into your earth star, blessing and sealing your earth star. And gently release the visualization. On that note, I hope my I hope my short video has helped to answer the queries I've received, even though it's been brief. I hope my short video has helped to answer the questions that I've received around the Earth Star explains the Earth Star Chakra in a bit more practical detail. And I hope you've enjoyed the short creative visualization as well, if you decided to follow along. Please feel free to contact me with any queries. The best way to get a hold of me is through my website, www.chloefolden.com. I look forward to hearing from you if you have any queries for me in relation to this video and topics that have been touched on. I'd just like to wish everyone a very blessed week and blessings to you with your decisions and choices and blessings to all of you with ideas and inspirations you're grounding. <laughs>